Welcome to another video of Code Legend. Today we will be seeing what's the difference between constant and read only keywords in C Sharp. Often developers get confused between these keywords when to use constant, when to use read only. This is always a confusion among the developers. So let's try to clear off that in this video. Both are used to store values which should not be changed later in the code or at runtime. But there is a difference. Const is more at a compile time whereas read only is at runtime. So that means constant variables must be assigned value when it is declared. Otherwise the compiler will throw an error. Whereas read only has both the options. Read only variables can be assigned value when it is declared as well as it can be assigned value in the constructor during the runtime as well. So on the right side you can see there is a constant variable which must be assigned a value. If we don't assign this value at declaration time the compiler won't allow us to proceed. Whereas read only can have both options. Read only variable can be assigned a value during the compile time as well as read only variable can be assigned value in the constructor of the class at the runtime as well. And it need not be hard coded like this, it can be fetched at the runtime. Whereas that option is not available for constant. Let's get into Visual Studio and see some code and make this more clear. Now we are in Visual Studio. And imagine you are creating a calculator class. For example, my special calculator. Now you will have few values which will never change. For example, our pi value which always remains constant. So such kind of values there is no need to change any time during the coding or during the runtime. So such kind of values can be declared as constant. For example, public const double pi. So this pi value is always 3.14 which will never change. So such kind of requirement whenever you have that the value will never change throughout your program and throughout your runtime, such kind of variables you can declare it as constant. Whereas variables which you think will be initialized in, with one value and later it will never be changed. Such kind of requirement can be used as read only variable. For example, you are creating this particular calculator class and you want to store the current year in one variable only during the initialization of this calculator. So that means whenever someone launches this calculator at that time current year will be fetched and stored into this variable. For example public read only int current year. You can either hard code it like this or instead what I'll do is I'll just declare this compiler will allow me and then I'll create the constructor and in the constructor I will assign the current year and let me assign that dynamically not hard code so what I can do is I can take help from the date time class so date time now dot year so now every time you create an instance of this particular class the constructor will be called and in the constructor it will fetch the current year and assign it to this particular variable and then throughout the execution of that program this value can never be changed so such kind of requirement you can use read only whereas as you have seen the constant value must be assigned here if i remove this part then immediately the compiler will start throwing an error saying that a const field requires a value to be provided so that is mandatory Whereas for read only you can assign the value here during the declaration as well or in the constructor at the runtime also you can initialize. One more major difference between the const and read only is const can be used within a method whereas read only is not allowed to be used inside a method. It should it must be a member variable. What does that mean? For example, you have a public void add method within your calculator and here you want to do some activities now here if you declare a const int val1 and you can assign a value 
and you can very well use this variable within your method whereas if you try to do the same with read only you can see you cannot create a read only value here if i do this so you can see it gives an error so compiler time itself modifier read only is not valid for this item so that's why in the intellisense also you don't see any read only option here so that is one major difference between the const and read only so to summarize whenever during coding you have a requirement wherein you want to save some value in a variable and that value you want to use throughout your coding and that value will never change in your code at compile time as well and at runtime as well so such kind of things you can use as constant so very well in this method i can use this variable pi to calculate some things whereas if you have a requirement that you want to store some value during the initialization of the object that means at the runtime and that should be done only at the first time and then later it never be changed at runtime so such kind of variables can be declared as read only so constant is compile time whereas read only is at runtime hope this was clear and hope this will help you in further coding thank you